שלום again, my name is Nishai Ismael. Who we're seeing here is the image of Mentuhotep. Mentuhotep was the beginning of the end of Dynasty 11 of Egypt. Now for those who do know, that is like toward the beginning of the Middle Kingdom of Egypt. For those who also know, that's one of my favorite particular studies regarding Egypt in this particular case. Now, just for edification purposes, he was responsible for what is referred to as making Lower Egypt and Upper Egypt united again, all right? In this particular case, it is referred to as Sematawi. Sematawi meaning the unity of the two lands, all right? Ta meaning the land, Sema meaning unity. So just wanted to point that out. That's why you get Ta Siti, Ta Meri, Ta Mehu, Ta Siti, so forth and so on, all right? Um, so, just wanted to point that out. Dynasty 11, the beginning of the end of Dynasty 11, going to Dynasty 12. He had, for edification purposes, a guy named Amenahat the first who was advising him. Amenahat the first became the first ruler of Dynasty 12. Then, as you know, time went on, you had further kings within, referred to as the Middle Kingdom. What I've noticed with the tour guides, and I say this in no disrespect, is they seem to have focused, at least in my visit over here, primarily because we're maybe in Northeast Egypt, they focus primarily with the old kingdom, the old kingdom, and no knock on that. However, what we want to do in these short brief videos is talk about the matter of the Middle Kingdom and going into what they call the Hekuso Sweat, or the rulers of former lands, said as Hyksos in Greek. Thank you, take care, Shalom.